Well, hello there, everybody. Dre here, and welcome back to Dre Grass Incorporated. Today, we're going to slay some more lawns and hopefully make a lot of money. Actually, I've already made a lot of money. Surprise, surprise. I really wanted to get a better HQ in the next episode, so we're doing that right away. As you can see, I got 41k in the bank. I have been a busy dude trying to run a successful lawn mowing empire, and finally, we are moving up in the world um, I guess I can't buy Moderna Estate. I don't know if I need unlimited bays anyways. What I really wanted was this Windsor Garages. So we're going to buy that. We're going to have 20k left to even get some more upgrades. Mind you, we're probably going to have to buy quite a few lawnmowers because we can have multiple employees now. But look at this. This is nice. Okay, I'm confused. This has HQ fully upgraded, but when I click it, I can buy an upgrade. Um, I did notice that I have four out of six garage bays, so I'm assuming I gotta get this to get... What did I just do? All right, so I forgot that we have upgrades in progress, and that's gonna give me one more bay. So yeah, we start... I mean, it kind of lies. It says we have six bays when we buy it, but we have to upgrade the place to actually get those six bays. That's fine. Four is more than enough. If you're not very good at math, that's double what we have right now. So that means we got more things to buy and more employees to get. Reggie is scared of AI. So yeah, you know what? I think he's good to have on my side. We're going to hire him just because of that. <laughs> I don't know why. Oh, they own 16 cats. All right, Amber, you're, you're on the team. <laughs> oh, wait, Amber, no. The maximum number of employees I can have is two. At my current rep level. Okay, clearly I bought the HQ too freaking early. Um, I guess we're going to have to focus on doing some more advertising so we can gain more rep. And look at that happy family. Now for the fun part, uh, I guess we only need to buy one lawnmower now. So let's see what we can actually afford. Uh, going up, we can get the Turf Tiger 2, which is the upgraded version of the Patriot. Uh, a deck size of 155 centimeters. I really did want this knight. Ooh, 22.5. That's not far off, and with that 182 centimeter deck size, that is, that's the biggest deck in the game. I cannot not get this thing. This just looks like a dad's wet dream. This is a man's lawnmower, so you know what? I think I'm just gonna play it safe. I don't wanna exit career mode. Actually, I wanna try something. Being that we only own two lawnmowers, can I just force them to work and I, and I just chill and make money? There we go. Do I just let them go? Oh, wait, wait, what? So I have to choose myself. Now, do we share the lawnmower? Let's just try this. We have, okay, we only have two jobs. So it looks like as the owner, I have to go out. Weather warning. While on contracts, the weather is wet. You need to take extra care when cutting as it easier damage the ground. The wet grass is also more difficult to cut and place more load on your vehicle's engine. Great. Well, you know what? I want to try something anyways. This is so douchey, but I just want to see if it happens. We're going to skip everything. And we're going out and <laughs> we're going back. And this is what you definitely don't want to do as a small business. But we're just going to pretend that we were never here. The question is, how much money do I lose if I do this? <laughs> 25 cents. Now, do we get paid? Yes, we actually get paid from our employees jobs. So if you wanted to be a douche, you could just do that every day and make a lot of money. And that's exactly what I'm going to do, at least till I get my new fancy lawnmower. Ah, oh, isn't it fun abusing game mechanics, ladies and gentlemen? It's 25 cents every time. And look at that. A nice 3,100 with that major orchard job. God, that is so unbelievably cheap. I am not going to lie, but uh, you know what? Now we got 26k in the bank. It's safe to say that money's going to be pretty much effortless if I do want it to be, of course. Now let's waste no time. I'm so excited. These ones are really cool too, but let's slow down a little bit. Let's get the old knight. We haven't had like a generic rider lawnmower either. This is going to be really difficult, I feel like. It's going to be extremely long. But you know what? With that deck size, I mean, I have to buy it just because it looks so damn fun. And there we go. What kind of upgrades can we get to this or attachments? Okay, so we can get the mulch plate. Oh, 99 bucks. Of course, I'll do that. That way, I don't have to worry about gr grass clippings. That's it for this one, though. All we have is a mulch plate, so that means no fancy lawn striping with this, but we should be able to do lawns extremely quickly. All right, of course, we got to repair and refuel my other vehicle, so now we are good. Can we get a new employee? We did level up a bit. Oh, we have a professional now. You know what, Mila? Yeah, you can join us. Just because you have a crippling fear of toads. 
All right, and finally, let's get out there and actually do some real uh, clipping today. I'm going to start. Looks like we don't. We already did the training field, so I don't want to do that one again. Let's just do something easy just to test out this lawnmower. So we're going to go back to Rowley Manor with the big beast here. Now, we're always going to get this with this above recommended range, especially now. I don't even know if I'll be able to do this. Hopefully, I can. And then we'll just throw the rest of our guys on whatever's worth a lot of money. All right. And uh, a nice, beautiful day out. Now, it is raining. That means we can rip up the ground more. Uh, also, the grass is going to be heavier. So this will be a great first trial with this thing. Look at the size of this. This is insane. Okay. Why am I running backwards every now and then? I am not doing that intentionally. Um, no, I, do, I don't want to skip the ground check. Man, this is uh, a lot more tight than I thought. Maybe it's just the back because there's this massive field in the back. This looks like a one-star job. Extremely simple, which is exactly what I wanted. What the hell was that noise? All right, here we go. Let's start the engine up. Oh, yes. Oh, this feels good. Put up that throttle. Look at the size of this. I, oh, my God. I already damaged something. Oh, I didn't even know it's articulating. Dude, okay, this is a lot cooler than what, what I actually thought. Oh my god, it's got a backup beeper just because it's so freaking big. Okay, let's try and lower that deck. Okay, and there we go. So I just had to lower the deck. It's hard to remember everything we need to do. Now, engage blades. How fast can I go? I'm, tr I'm trying full speed. I'm cutting the wrong height. What are you talking about? It's six centimeters. Oh, I, th I thought it was five to six. It was 4.5 to 5.5. Okay, thanks for letting me know. Well, we'll drop it down to five. Let's just do a quick backup here. And away we go. Now, it's nice to see that I can go full throttle again. It feels like a century since I've been last able to do this. This is going to be hard to get used to. Having those zero degree turns on the other lawnmowers is extremely nice. Now I'm on like an actual rider. Don't get me wrong. It has an articulated frame. Still a lot more difficult. But with the width of this blade, we are going to do these jobs so freaking quickly. So yeah, I definitely don't see this lawnmower being the best in all jobs. But if we have an open field just like this where we don't have to go around things too much, this is going to be by far the fastest. Like, I'm full throttle right now. No problem at all. I'm only going 6.5 miles per hour, but still. That's more than fast enough with how wide this thing is. You got to remember, this is almost double as wide as my other lawnmower. <laughs> so it's just, it's like nothing. This is fantastic. I'm so glad I decided to buy this one instead. You can only truly appreciate this, the size of this thing in third person. It is... It is a beast. The only annoying thing is the lack of the striping tool because I do like trying to get those pleasing lines, but we'll definitely be using the other lawnmowers for more of that stuff. This is just all about these big fields. Definitely hard trying to get these final lines with the turning radius. I, I miss my turning on a dime, but that's okay. I just need to do a little bit of wider turns at the end or just maybe spread out my lines a little bit more. Not the end of the world with how fast the rest of this stuff is on this lawnmower. There we go. We are, well, pretty much done. The game allows me to finish now, but of course I'm going to get that last little bit. There we go. Well, I got to say it's exactly what I wanted. It's just a big lawnmower. Oh my God, that was some bad damage. That can do a lot of cutting really, really quickly. All right, and there we go. We have uh, quite a few penalties, but that doesn't matter. I'm making lots of money now because I have employees to earn money for me, goddammit. And there we go. Just like that, we just earned so much money. Oh, man. Okay, I've been looking for some that we haven't done yet. I don't think we did anything with Dutchman's Lookout. So uh, I've cl collected litter here before, but I never actually cut it. Gotta be honest, I don't remember how difficult it is, but it's a three-star. I feel like that's gonna be fun with the OFT. Uh, so we're gonna try that one. There's actually a bunch of high-paying ones right now, so this is gonna be a good day. Okay, this is nice. I dig this. This is actually freaking huge, though, so this is gonna be fun. Look at all these things I have to avoid. Yeah, we're gonna get lots of fines here. My god, this is... I don't even know if this is worth all the effort, but I'm, I'm, I'm gonna try. This is brutal, too. There's even, like, these little side areas that are just the world's smallest pieces of lawn. You gotta remember, if I keep my blades on... These pathways can be damaging, so this is going to be a deceptively difficult job. And then, like, look at this. Like, why? Why would you have yard here? Just just finish it with more garden, goddammit. 
I'm actually mad. Okay, well, I mean, it is a park, so it is supposed to be big. I'm never going to find these final two objects with how big this place is. There it is. Ah, oh, stupid tennis ball. Okay, that took a long time. So we'll do it at a nice stable six. And uh, I guess what I'm going to have to do is just do each one of these lawns because we're going to have all these trails in the way. I feel like doing one at a time is probably my best bet. Morning, you were cutting the wrong grass. Use Proveal. Oh, wait, I am cutting. What are you talking about? I am cutting the right grass. You're confusing me. All right, well, my percentage is going up, so this is definitely the right grass. The game's just wrong, damn it. Um, that being said, is this all I got to do over here then? This whole area over there, I don't have to do. Sick. Okay, this is a lot easier than what I thought. It's still going to be fun trying to maneuver this beast around this l freaking place. I'm already hitting things. Great. Okay, yeah, this is definitely not made. <laughs> for these advanced turns. Ah, damn it already. Oh, I didn't see that there, I swear. Oh my god, I'm gonna get fired. And I'm and I'm the boss, so that doesn't even make sense. Okay, yeah, this is this is pretty much the worst. This is this is this is too much lawnmower for for one lawn. God damn it, I did it again. Okay, I did it again. No, it still says I'm cutting the wrong grass. Stop lying to me. I, I know this is the right grass. Okay, the first lawn pretty much done. The fact that this took, you know, five minutes to do kind of shows that just because we have a very fancy and expensive lawnmower doesn't necessarily mean it's always the best option. Oh my god, this is, this is stupid. This is... Why? Why would you have lawn here? <laughs> I destroyed a flower? Really? I was taking that so slow. Oh god, can I destroy these? Are these even flowers? Oh, I, I hit that. Oh my god, I'm destroying things. I can't wait to see the penalties on this job. Jesus, this is stupid. All right, back up. <laughs> we don't need to go forward all the time. Okay. Oh, okay. I don't think I hit the plants behind me. There we go. <laughs> that was not fun. Okay, and here we go to a field that actually might be good with this size of lawnmower. to maneuver this beast it is truly fast of course i destroy a flower right there yeah you know what i just hate gardens oh whoa, 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 whoa. oh god okay i can't wait to see what that fine is it's these damn wheels in the front don't don't get me wrong i understand why they're there but i keep getting them wrapped around poles and whatnot not very fun all right another major field pretty much all done i gotta say uh once you get used to the sheer size of this thing it's not too bad as you can see we're a little over 20 minutes into this uh i think this job was like a thousand bucks so yeah we're definitely still going very fast all things considered just due to the sheer size of this thing i think all we got to do now is these little side areas it might just be this one right here yeah we are rapidly going up as you can see um oh i'm not gonna be able to do that churn oh okay destroying more freaking plants it's a common occurrence with this thing but yeah i definitely didn't enjoy this when i first started but uh i could see myself using this lawnmower probably for a while if it didn't have this articulated frame though yeah i think i would probably just sell it because that would be a freaking nightmare and there we missed a little bit but there we go 99.8 all right there it is nice and slow back up i've learned driving forward bottoms this thing out and i'm assuming i get extra penalties because of that so it's all about that strategy okay and yeah there we go 1200 i did get a lot of penalties with this big thing 19 dollars in flower destruction oh i love it okay there we go how did my other guys do same price as me a little less than me not bad at all all right guys and that's gonna wrap it up for this episode of lawn mower sim i hope you guys enjoyed the upgrades today uh definitely a different experience on the night don't know how much I'm going to use this thing, if I'm honest. I definitely do think I prefer these a little bit more just because they're so maneuverable. But I think it's a good thing we add to the fleet for those giant yards, as I said, that are very, very easy. Because it will probably would be the fastest choice for that. So yeah, as always, guys, thanks for watching and liking. And I'll see you in the next one.